Here we go. Catch it. Drive him back. Tag, then throw. This is Tim Corbin, head baseball coach at Vanderbilt University. Now we're going to move on to first base picks. This is a drill that I used to do with a fungo bat in which I'd hit balls at first base. I couldn't move the ball specifically to where I wanted it to go. I started adding the rookie machine because it added more precision to the drill so I could put the ball wherever I want. I could shorten the hop, lengthen the hop, just with a little small adjustment. So we'll toss some balls out of here and show you what it looks like. Okay, the location of the machine is right on the mound and what it does is it simulates the pitcher throwing the ball to the infielder. Okay, what we're doing right now is we're just rotating a first baseman one at a time. He catches a ball, the next first baseman snaps up right behind him. If a young man has a weakness, maybe going to his glove side, I can put a dozen balls, right one right after another, in a short amount of time. If I want to add velocity to the baseball, I just adjust the speed control just a little bit. Now, the other thing I can do is there's a crank system down here on the leg. I can adjust this to swivel it left and right, and I can add pace to this just by the speed of how quickly I want to feed the ball. With a control elevator, I can move it down. If I want it down low in the dirt, or if I want it up a little bit higher, where I have to raise their glove, I can do so just like that. 